Kate Conti, Miss New York 2011. And now, I ended up being the one who was penalized for it and has become the person who stands up against so many people in her school who are aggressors, so often taking detentions for what was right and not letting the system tell her how someone should be treated and when to ignore it. And she and I have worked together on several events. Oh and she has really gone above and beyond what most young people do. She's a brilliant musical artist, oh and she has used her music not only in charitable events all over Rochester, where I've seen her, but she's written songs about bullying and uses her music as a way to express and help communicate with other students who are going through similar issues. So if I could please invite Tiffany Sky oh up here on stage with me. Oh my God. <laughs> Scholarship for the Miss New York organization in the amount of a thousand dollars for the incredible oh work that God. you do and the commitment that you've had to the Rochester area <laughs> and in all my years that it took for me to finally find the strength I have to fight and make the impact I have at your age going into your senior year to be making the impact you happen to have lost so much and yet have gained so much in your own strength. I am so proud of you and thank you so much for being here tonight. Oh, <laughs> I want to thank everyone, Tiffany's mom, and I want to thank the Miss New York organization and Golden Eagle, and of course all of the donors who over the past few weeks who have helped me build this out, and I look forward to being able to grow this and help as many young leaders as possible to help me build out my upstander army of young people who are standing up for what is right and for treating each other right. So thank you all so much for being part of this year and letting me make that impact.
legislation in the state of New York, and more importantly, uh, that the young people around our great state of New York, uh, who aren't feeling very good about themselves because of constant bullying or anything else, uh, have a role model like Caitlin Monty. Wow. That's so great. So, one of, the great things, uh, one of the great things that I get to do as a state senator uh, is proclaim days. Uh, so this week in Albany, uh, we proclaimed June 16th. 2012, all over the state of New York, as Caitlin Monty Day. <laughs> um, if you haven't read the program book, please see because the only person I have to thank is everyone in the audience and every single student, every single teacher, every single police officer, and every single person on this 
in the state who has participated in this with me. I didn't accomplish anything we did, so thank you. I set out with the mission, but this had nothing to do with me. This had to do with thousands of people who had something they wanted to do, and all I was was a catalyst. So thank you to every single person who's here and facilitating that chance for the next woman, and every single person who does this for people in their own lives every day. Thank you. And girls, good luck, and I hope you know that it doesn't take a crown to do what we just did, and you guys can keep going, and every single person in the audience, you don't need a crown to be Miss America. Winning is one thing, being is another, so please find your Miss America and have fun with it. Thank you. Thank you, Caitlin. this and help as many young leaders as possible to help me build out my upstander army of young people who are standing up for what is right and for treating each other right. So thank you all so much for being part of this year and letting me make that impact. I'm so proud of you. And thank you so much for being here tonight. Oh, my God. So funny.